Thank you for having me this afternoon. In the next three, five, and 20 years, most of your operating agreements will end. And absolutely the most important advocacy work that you have to take on, as you already took on, is the absolute defense of protecting this wonderful concept called co-op housing, as well as the affordability that it avails to other members of your co-ops. You must all, all ask all levels of government to commit to a simple concept and a commitment, which in the States, we called it a no net loss commitment. No net loss of affordability, no let lo net loss of commitment. As we grow to expand our sector and our portfolio, we must defend and protect what we have today and not let one single unit slip through or one single family fall through the safety net. Thank you. But the end of this era also means that six to eight billion dollars in real estate assets will be released to local control. And I want you to look at that bullet and remember, released to local control, meaning your control. So how do you move from here on out? There will be mounting responsibilities as your housing age. They will be 20 years old, 30 years old, 40 years old before you know it. Roofs, boilers, plumbing, some of you are already struggling with those issues. There will be huge challenges to defend those low-income families who will fall through the federal safety net if there's no support below it. But again, you have unparalleled opportunities, and that's what you need to really focus your attention on. You gotta think big, think bold, and really be prepared to innovate. In a few years, you will no longer have the same kind of relationship with your federal government, but in a few years, you should no longer think about yourself as a small player in the housing delivery system. Just imagine that you'll be sitting collectively on a national real estate portfolio worth billions of dollars. How do you leverage is the question. How do you, as a cooperative movement and sector, pool your resources, your knowledge, your energies to make something out of what you have so that the sum of the whole will be greater than the sum of the parts? The road forward is unknown. You don't know what lies ahead, except that you see blue sky and blue water, and you can feel the fresh air in your face. This is going to be a dynamic new era. If you care to think, if you care to say, we are not going just fall and plead for the federal government to please do your share, hell, we're going to hold you accountable for that, but we're going to find another way through the spirit of the co-op movement. It's your home, it's your community, and eventually your decision to go forward. Best of luck to you. Thank you for having me.